So studio maintenance is a studio time to clean. We do it because our studio is a mess in elementary, like a complete disaster usually. Cause after lunch, it's like messy, it's so gross. It's like trash all over the floor. And we do studio maintenance to make it, help it clean up. So studio maintenance is this certain time period that we clean our studio, because we need to keep our studio sacred. Studio maintenance is a real struggle for middle school, um, but it's everyone has their own assigned job, and we kind of just like all contribute to help cleaning. And it's basically um, leadership, um, taking the initiative. You have to clean up what you mess up. It's kind of like a life skill, because no one is going to be your maid. No one is going to clean for you once you get out into life. So you have to learn to clean yourself, and that's why the forest school does studio maintenance. We have to be responsible for it, and we have to clean up our own messes. We have studio maintenance because it allows the learner to grow an understanding and a respect for their studio. They're able to make their own rules. They're able to hold each other accountable. So allowing them to clean as well just adds another level of respect that they grow to learn for the studio. So when they are leaving for the day, they need to be picking up after themselves, cleaning up after themselves, making sure that the space they use is how they would want it to be. Studio maintenance, um is self-directed. So there are gonna be times if, if parents show up at our, our studio or our school, there are gonna be times where it's not clean. There are gonna be times where like learners drop the ball um, and learn from feedback from their peers, from consequences of uh, being in a messy space. And it's really helping teach them the basics of what it means to clean, attention to detail, um, and follow through is a really big one. Um, so when they're not doing that, again, asking the questions of what it looks like and how you like your space to look, feel, and smell, um, I say would be super important. Parents can really help with studio maintenance by allowing them to do it at home. Stop picking up behind them. When they leave a dish, call it out. Hey, can you come and pick up your things? Does this look neat? Is this how you found it? Those kinds of questions that you can kind of ask to prod. Studio maintenance is a really fascinating learning experience. And to be honest, it could be designed for lots of different reasons. I mean, practically, the school needs to be clean in some way, but also responsibility to be able to teach learners how to be responsible for themselves and their actions. But even that's not the primary reason why we designed studio maintenance the way that we did. The primary reason is to build trust. Can I be trusted to sweep the floor? I said that I would. It's the role that I've been assigned. Will I do it? Will I do it in a timely manner? Will I do it well and with quality? 